Kumusta na po kayo? Habi and I are here in... Where are we? Devil's Marbles. Devil's Marbles Hotel. Look at that. But this is not one of those um, holiday getaway. No, we're working. Yeah, we're here for work. We were hired as um, entertainers. <laughs> entertainers for the kids in a in an aboriginal school community so kami dalawa na hire kami na mag ano gumawa ng jobs para sa entertainment ng mga bata so i wasn't gonna vlog but hubby said it would be you know worth letting you know a little bit of us so and what we do kaya lang baka bawal doon eh bawal bawal mag oh, ayan yan pala yung sinasakyan namin guys yan yung truck dala namin Ayan guys, oh ang sunset. Ay, hindi, hindi siya klaro. Hmm. So, hindi na tayo pupunta doon sa ano guys? Sa mga malalaking bato. <laughs> Kasi nakita niyo naman yun, di ba? So, ito yung uh, hotel accommodation uh, for the people who are visiting Devil's Marbles. Look at that. Nice. So, bukas guys, um, punta natin sa community. Baka pwede ako mag-film konti about the area. I will do. Pero baka bawal um, kunan yung mga bata of course. So, but at least you will see what an Aboriginal community looks like. Magpapaalam ako doon sa ano, kung pwede ba. Anyway, sabi daw may nabalitaan ako na... Ang chef daw dito sa Devil's Marbles Hotel ay Filipino. Kaya baka may mga Filipino food sila for us. We will check it out later. So, ayan si Javi. Ipapark niya na yung truck. And we're going inside. See you later. Ito tayo sa cabin guys. And let's have a quick look of this cabin. So that's the kitchen over there. Look at that with the fridge. And that's Darren. And they also got a uh, television. Look at that. Completo. Puntahan naman natin sa bilisan natin puntahan ang room guys kasi uh, alis na kami. Mag magdi-dinner na kami. Ma early daw sila dito mag-close. So, ito naman ang kanilang pa-shower and toilet. Ayun. Hindi ba? And here's the bedroom. Ang ganda. Diba? Sobrang ganda na yun. Kasi, imagine, we're four hours away from Alice Springs. Tapos, meron ka pa din ganitong accommodation. We are very lucky. Bukas, maaga kami na alis mga before 6 o'clock. Kasi, we're going on a dirt road. Sobrang layo pa kasi nung pupuntahan namin na community. Talagang in a very remote area. So, hopefully, pwede tayong mag-film doon para makita nyo din naman, ma-share ko din naman sa inyo kung ano ba mga pinagsasabi ko. Tingnan nyo guys, ito lang dala ko. Wala talaga kasi, di ba? Just for one day. We'll have a work tomorrow for the whole day. Entertaining the kids. And then, uuwi din kami bukas din after work. So, we'll see kung, kung mapagod ang driver natin. Baka mag-stop over kami sa, mga, sa isang roadhouse. If not, we'll just go straight home to Alice Springs. Join us for dinner later. Ayan guys, ang bilis talagang dumilim. Kanina may araw pa yun. Ayan, madilim na. So, we're going in and let's check if totoo ba ang balita. Guys, dito na tayo sa loob ng restaurant. In a dirt road, he's busy looking at the map. I've got Wi Fi. Well, not Wi Fi, I've got Telstra. Ganda talaga ng kanila pag painting ng Devil's Marble sa liquid, guys. Devil's Marble sa Nami. Ah, nakikita niyo naman ang Devil's Marble sa aking ibong. Pink in the house. 
sobrang in love kay Darren. I got pink boots. <laughs> Big one. Down in the house. Can't get my phone. Welcome to the devil's house. <laughs> Malayo na kasi ito guys. Mga, as I've said before. All my fans. What am I going to do? Try away from all his friends. All my one fan. In the middle of nowhere. He's worried because he wants to talk to his number one fan. Me? <laughs> Which is him. <laughs> Excited na ako mag-order. Habi said we'll just wait, pero parang hindi yata kami mag-wait. We need to go to the bar, darling. No, you don't go to the bar. This is the restaurant. Alright. So guys, ayun na nga guys. Narealize na ni Habi na we need to go to the bar to order the food. Walang pupunta dito sa bar. Uh, but it's a very fast service. Look at that. Not even like 10 minutes. Mm, fast. Yeah. This is our entree. I just got this garlic bread all for himself. <laughs> and, uh, my. What did you get me there? Um, some Filipino thing. Yeah, it's Filipino calamari. <laughs> but guys, it's in my bag. It's all good Filipino chef. Let's taste it. It's $29, guys. So, I'm just telling you the price. It's para sabihin na ay ang mahal na. You know, to, to give you an idea the difference in prices here in Alice Springs at Jan Sapinas. We're in the middle of nowhere, so we're not even at Alice Springs. Yeah, we're not even in Alice Springs, so. Four hours away. Four hours away, kaya kung medyo mahal ba. Thankful ka na dahil kasi wala kang choice. Ito lang ang area nila dito. We are thankful we can get food. Very, very grateful that we have this food. Good food. In the middle of nowhere. Sarap ng kalamari nila guys. Iba talaga pag Pinoy chef. I can taste the difference. Okay. It's worth it. Worth the four hour drive. <laughs> Did you like your garlic bread? Yeah, it's good. Look at that, guys. My my bar bartender. Oh, <laughs> professional bartender, the one. <laughs> Too big, the one. Kaini na muna namin ng country, guys. Ha, ayan si Tara, no? And then later we will show you our main courses. So, nakain na muna kami guys ha. Let's eat. So guys, tapos na kami sa aming entree. And here are our main dish. What do you have there, Darren? Wow. Garamandi, chips, salad. Absolutely beautiful dish. Look at that. Wow. Stunning. Tingnan nyo naman ang akin guys. Nakakasuasu pa siya kahit Filipino. Sisi! Yan! Yan lang po guys. Let's try this one. Sisi! Ito siya guys. Ano naman siya guys? $33. Sobrang sarap. Kailangan mo kumahin ng madami. Ay, I need to eat a lot because we'll be working. Who day tomorrow? No breakfast tomorrow. Okay, ito na guys. Bawi bawi na to guys. Breakfast and lunch na ito combined. <laughs> breakfast and lunch combined. Let's eat. Yummy? <laughs> Yum, sisi. Guys, di ko na maubos. Sobrang dami kasi. Kaya, take out na lang. <laughs> Para kainin ko bukas sa breakfast. Kasi di ba, kaalis kami ng maaga. Mga wala pang 6 o'clock. Kaya close pa tong kanilang restaurant. So, kain na lang ako sa room. E di tipid. Diba? Ganyan talaga ang mais na Pilipina. So, we just finished our job at the school community. But we weren't able to take uh, videos or photos or vlog because 
I got too shy to ask the principal. But she was nice, eh? Yeah, it was a good job, and yeah. the, kid, the children were good also. They don't really like to take photos. So, yeah. just do the right thing. Yeah. Like, we're on a rough bit of road at the moment, so we've stopped. We tried to stop before, but um, I don't say stop, but you just can't stop in these roads. If you have a, we'll show you the road, how it actually gets, it gets corrugated yeah. and, and it goes in hard and rock. So we can, uh, later on, Alan will show you what the road is like, it's pretty bad. Yes. Guys, pakita ko lang sa inyo guys, itong Thermite Mound guys. Ito ay, tignan nyo guys, oh. Ito siya, ano yan siya guys, bahay ng mga langgam or amigas pa sa Bisaya. Ayan guys, oh yung isang termite man. It's only up to Darren's. So only up to my ankle. Wow, he thinks he's very tall. Six foot six <laughs> and a half. Six foot six and a half though siya guys. I'm going to show you a, a picture of a bigger, of a very big thermite mount which we saw in our trip um, to Catherine. Marami yun. Malalaki. Up here it's very interesting. You can see that uh, in Australia our tyres grow on thermite mount. Huh? Yeah. Oh, what happens is when we uh, here when we need some tyres we will ask the termites to grow them for us and as you can see the termites <laughs> grow in this tyre for us. <laughs> Tumubo na yung ano niya. Tumubo na. Gawa yan siya ng mga langgam guys. Ayan guys oh. Tingnan nyo. I don't know if you can see it. But there's there's the termite. There's the culprit. And Ayan. they've grown. They've got the tire. So nasa truck na tayo guys. Bye termite man. Let's go. Let's go darling. Let's start jiggling again. Bye termite man. Stop na naman kami kasi may ipapakita daw si Habi sa inyo. What is it that you want them to see? Hi guys, we've just seen uh, the latest cars. So we've got some really nice cars here at Adelkarung where you could, uh, the latest car dealers. So if I just show you, uh, we've got oh, some really neat Holden cars and you probably hear this is the Australian car called Holden. So just come around here and there's the beautiful Holden cars. And uh, this car dealership is uh, quite expensive. So most of these cars are pretty expensive to buy. Uh, this, this car here is, uh, it comes with the latest bull bar. So if you want to buy one of these, probably looking at a few thousand dollars. Beautiful bull bar on that one. And if you look at the, the dealership over there, you can see more and more of the, our beautiful cars which we're selling. Uh, just trying to pick a nice car out for my beautiful wife. We've also got a few cars over here. We, we call them the, the hot rods, the squash models. And so, this one here, I think uh, my, my dear brother Bong would love this. This is the, the hot rod. <laughs> and uh, we also sell new upside down cars. Okay, as you can see, we've got the upside down car there. And then we've got a, our other cars are all over there, but we're not going to walk all that far. That's all our other cars. You can see them in the distance. All the latest cars over there. So, thank you for shopping at our car yard, Ali Karung, and uh, I hope you've enjoyed our little bit of a vlog. Bye.